I'm happy to introduce our new CMX500, the 5G one-box signaling tester from Rode in Schwarz. The CMX500 one-box tester now comes with integrated RF units that work in frequency ranges up to 8 gigahertz, which is important for LTE, 5G FR1, but also for Wi-Fi. For customers using the CMX500 for FR2 testing, the CMX can be optionally equipped with IF boards for FR2 testing. In this configuration, the one-box tester, which has two RF units and two IF units, we can provide an instantaneous bandwidth of 10 gigahertz, which ultimately could lead up to 10 gigabit per second end-to-end -end data. The CMX500 one-box tester is operated by our CM Squares user interface for all phases of R&D, from early R&D, core box RF testing, protocol testing, and end-to-end -end verification. In today's demo, we want to test the CMX500 against a real device um, to showcase throughput tests um, up to 10 gigabit per second. Since this requires FR2 testing, we also involve remote radio heads and our anechoic chamber, the ATS800R. So let's have a closer look. For today's demonstration, we have placed the device under test, a Qualcomm X65 chipset in our FR2 anechoic chamber, the new model of ATS800R. This new version comes with improved shielding capabilities for lower frequencies, such as LTE or FR1. Furthermore, ATS800R provides optional um, capabilities for 3D positioning, or even an inbuilt thermal camera for heat dissipation tests. The test case we will show you will use an NRDC configuration of one FR1 cell and eight additional FR2 carriers. All of that is being controlled by our CM Squares user interface and how this looks in detail, I will show you now. So what you see here is our web-based graphical user interface CM Squares so to speak, the control center of the CMX500 for the R&D use cases. And we are currently here in the interactive mode where customers can do kind of manual tests. And as you can see here on the right hand side in the network square, we have established an NRDC network deployment with one FR1 cell, which is the anchor cell here, and eight FR2 cells. And all the cells have a um, a scheduling to reach max throughput here and uh, what we do now is to attach the device under test this is what you see here in the DUT square where you see that we are connected in NR and now we are sending max throughput data over the channel above the DUT square we have also the so-called bearer and flow monitor where you can see which device and uh, which IP address the device under test got and also the QoS flows that are connected to the PDU session. So we are starting now the Blair measurements and now you can see here all measurements um, on each of the cells. So you see the FR1 cell and also the additional FR2 cells and you get an overall calculation of the downlink throughput which is here now 8 gigabit per second uh, which is mainly uh, one gigabit per second on, on, the, on each of the FR2 layers. The CMX500 one-box tester provides highest performance for all cellular network deployments from LTE to 5G, FR1 and FR2. Together with all other 5G equipment for FR2 testing like remote radio heads or chambers, Rode & Schwarz provides the most versatile and highest integrated portfolio in the market.